All right, so I'm live right now. Whenever you're ready, introduce yourself, brother. Yo, yo, yo. It's Bassanova, B-A-S-S-A-N-O-V-A. And if you want the handle, it's underscore 5X with that. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah. So what's up, man? What, what motivated you? What inspired you to get in the game? Um, I mean, I can look at my inspirations. I've always listened to music. I can say Gucci. Being from the South, I'm from Alabama. Everybody from the 205, Birmingham, Alabama. So I'm going to say Gucci, a real Alabama native, if you didn't know that. Okay, okay. did not know that. Uh, he's from Macadori. I actually played against his team, um, not his personal team when he was there, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I played against his school uh, team. Homie's dropping facts right uh, now. Bro. Hey, I'm like that. Hell yeah, brother. Hell like yeah. That. Um, Chief Keef. Like, yeah. just being being kind of the young person who I am. I'm 21 everybody years old. Everybody loves Sosa, baby. Uh, everybody loves everybody, Sosa. Oh, everybody shit. loves Sosa. Uh, I, I, got mean, I remember my boy R.I.P. Sleazy. He started crying when he when the when the rumors were spread that that uh, that he that he got killed, right? Oh. My boy, we're at a party, bro, and he started crying, bro. Like, R.I.P. Sleazy, bro. R.I.P. Sleazy. Miss you, brother. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Um, so, so we got we got uh, uh, Gucci, Gucci man, Chief, Chief, Soldier Boy, Soldier Boy. All right. right, he changed the game like, like just how he was, how he went on the internet and just like he really changed the game. He really, yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah, was yeah. on that. I should have been paying attention back then, bro. Like he, hundred percent, hundred percent. I should have been paying attention, bro. I was just on that. Like I don't know. Like my brother like put me on a lot of music. Like and I was about to say my last one, Lil Wayne. Oh, he put bro. me on Lil Wayne, and that's what kind of like kickstarted it everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Lil Wayne and Gucci. And I was just you heard like Lil Wayne rap, and you're like, I could do that. Hey, at that age. I'm like a lightweight diss to him. I'm just talking no. shit, Wayne. If you ever do watch this, uh, <laughs> no. I'm gonna show, one day I'm gonna show him that shit. Of course. All oh, right, right. Hey, we manifesting. Yeah. We manifest over here. Law of attraction. That. When he Hell does yeah. see this, he goes see, see this. He, he goes see, see this. Uh, <laughs> oh yeah, brother. Hell yeah. So, uh, um, so what? What is like one of your greatest obstacles that you overcame doing this music shit? Oh. Oh. I would say finding finding out thinking that I was gonna be like I'm not trying to word this a one hit wonder. Yeah. I was not like a one hit wonder, but I was gonna have that one song that made me blow up. Yeah. I was gonna be that young kid. I that, would love that. <laughs> no, really, who wouldn't? Right, bro. I tried to manifest that for a long time, but I wasn't manifesting in the right way, and I wasn't doing it the right way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and I thinking about the money of it too, because I'm not gonna lie, I do business. I'm a I own two businesses, so I'm a CEO. Um, I'm not trying to. I'm trying to be completely independent as possible. I'm oh, not yeah. trying to get signed to a label. I'm actually trying to create my own label. Oh, dope. that was one of the questions I was going to ask you. <laughs> independent, or would you sign? You know, independent. I'm trying to say independent. Why, why, why wouldn't you sign though? You wouldn't I mean, sign to like a Little Wayne or OVO or something like that. Nah, nah, I mean, bro. Not hey, even. Bro, have you seen that video where where Drake is like, he's making uh, 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 Osiris sing? Yes. And he's all like, he's all, you owe me 50K, fucker. He, he said, if you sing your heart out right now, I'll take away that 50K. <laughs> I've seen that. So, like, you wouldn't, Look what you're going to be around money. I mean, it's like he's kind of punking him. But it's like, dude, I would love to pay a 50K debt by singing my heart out. <laughs> like, but it's That's like boss moves. Like, you love, he, he, although it's, it's causing your, or, or costing your creativity. He's like leveling you up. He right? is leveling you like, up. That's what I would think. I, I would totally sign if I could, bro. Hundred percent. It sounds like a great deal. I mean, just to me, I like even with my. I'm trying to make I, a collective myself. I thought like, what do you want me to rap about? I'll rap whatever the <laughs> fuck you want me to rap about. I don't care. Tell me those. <laughs> give me those beats. I don't give a fuck, bro. Hey, I want people with my with I'll my work, collective. Bro, I'm a worker, homie. <laughs> With my collective, I'm really just trying to have, like, when when it is happening, it is happening right now. I already got people. I'm making, like, graphic designers, um, skaters, taggers, um, artists, of course, music artists. Like, it's everything. So you got the umbrella going, right? You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I want everybody, I'm not trying to stunt nobody's growth. That's the thing. I see, like, a lot of other artists who own record labels like to stunt other yeah. artists' growth. I'm 100%. not about that. I yeah, really I grew up, yeah, I grew up... Uh, Shout out to Tang, shout out to Gambit. <laughs> but we would go record to their studios and then we would never get our songs. Damn. You know what I mean? Like, like, and it's just like, it's, it's, I don't know, maybe they just wanted to get paid, bro. But it's like, we're all poor back then. We're all kids almost. I, and it's crazy because like a Tank was like an older guy. But when I met him, he was only like, like 19. But he was huge and I, I was 16. 
Okay. So like, so like, I thought he was a grown ass man. Turns out he's only like four years older than me. <laughs> you know, so you thought he, he was like what? Yeah, 10 I thought years he was a grown ass man, bro. But nah, dude, <laughs> he was grown as fuck. But yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, you'd go record there, and it, and he'd hold your shit hostage. Okay. You know, it's like, it's like, hey, what's up with those songs? Oh yeah, I'll oh, send you the files or whatever. And then like, you know, you'd forget or whatever. And then like months go by, and be like, hey, what's up with those? Oh, I'm having problem finding them or whatever the fuck. It's just. Some bullshit, bro. No, you got to be on top of shit like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, like, I recommend, I recommend, because I do that, right? I got my own little label and all that. Okay. And I got people coming over. People that are serious, too. My house is in the kick it spot no more, bro. <laughs> like, like, I'm tired of motherfuckers coming over just trying to smoke weed. And just get kick it, Get drunk and kick it. Nah. We making Come money with your shit ready you, and get the fuck out of my house, bro. If you ain't my talking wife money, like you, a hundred percent, bro. You if know, if we ain't talking money, then why are we not? Dude, why are we like, talking? And I got love, or, bro. I got love. It's like, I, like to me, it's like, look, I'm gonna record you for free on the house. I'll even record your music video. It just has to be on my on my YouTube channel. Okay. You know what I mean? And That's I, respect. No. You know what I'm saying? Like I'll I hook get you that. up, bro. I'm putting it all out and everything, and I just but just got to be on my YouTube channel because I'm trying to build my shit, right? right? You know what I mean? I'm not charging you to come to my studio. I'm not charging you to do that. I'm just charging. I just like so that's what I recommend you too, right? Like if you're trying to bring up artists, as soon as they record a song, you probably go to ch- uh, you know who you know what Mid Journey is? No. The AI that you can just describe something and it'll make oh. a picture. Oh uh, no. Yeah. So like you could like make a song, then go to Mid Journey uh, and get a thumbnail. Oh, uh, automatically made right in instant, and then you post it up. Okay. So that's what that's what I'm gonna start doing, bro. You know what I mean? Not just that. Like, um, you could do Mid Journey, and Mid Journey gives you four different options, and then you can choose the option you like, and it'll give you four different options that look like that option. So then, so then, uh, so then you could uh, you can add all those pictures together, and it'll look like a like a video clip almost. You know okay. what I mean? Especially okay. if you know how to edit and do all that stuff. So, so in my head, I'm like, bro, you can even make a video off of that kind of shit. No, Just really. get all the stills and then make a still. No, a Lincoln lot of, Park did that. They actually, there's like two artists I've seen. Um, they actually just made AI videos. Like, yeah. they go crazy. Now you need to shout out Money Man. Like, he came out yeah, with that. Second, second Pioneer person. Pioneer in the AI game right now. Uh, if you do shit right was, now in the AI game for music-wise... You are considered a pioneer. So hey, that's maybe something I should get into. And Cali Kid, I just even seen some artists uh, promoted this yeah. whole other dude, Cali Kid. He was like actually like the first person to do an AI video. Yeah, Got yeah. the timestamp and everything. So like those two artists are really on top of it right now. They know how it is with the AI stuff. Yeah, yeah, Making yeah. a whole video, not like it's like interchangeable, like real life in yeah, like an AI, bro. Yeah. It looks sick. I'm not even gonna lie. That's I don't be that's, hating. That's amazing. I, I, like if it's good, yeah, hey, yeah. if it's great, it's great. It yeah, looks, that's it's pretty but great. We're, we're right now we're like at the uh we're like in the 90s of the dot com beer period right or 80s you know what i mean like people don't know what ai is i really. know people like have oh yeah i've seen youtube videos on it but i i asked you oh you know what mid journey is and you're like uh no nah, nah, really i use chat gpt chat gpt is great also you can use chat gpt to learn how to talk to mid journey Oh, okay. Dude, it's crazy, bro. It's really cool. There's shit. levels to it, guys. There is levels to this shit, my boy. Just like life, there's levels to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hundred percent, hundred percent, bro. So, like, yeah. Uh, uh, speaking of levels, like, uh, what do you? Uh, um, wh- when when did you feel like you leveled up? Because I remember I've had a couple of those moments where, like, it's like out of nowhere, I just leveled up. You ever had that? No. Yes, I know exactly. The real leveling up experience, I would say. The end of 2021 going into 2022. Yeah. Um, just doing a lot of soul searching. And, like, I'm not going to lie, I did a lot of psychedelics. Yeah, yeah. And, like, I really got that into... Helps. That uh, helps. It well. really do. If you don't, if you know, you know. Yeah, if yeah. you know, you know. Um, it really got myself, like... I really just learned myself, like, in a different aspect. What I want to do with life. How I want to do things with life. I knew I wanted to do music, but, like, I didn't want to feel like I'm getting pressured to, like make a certain type of music yeah, yeah. like don't get me wrong i could do ignorant rap i could do ignorant music but like that's not like my end goal with music i feel it i feel it but like and, and that's what i would be like as an artist now maybe when i was younger i would also be I, I would be on that hill and die on it right but now i'm grown i got a i got a wife i got kids i got rent i got everything bills to pay bro mm-hmm. so i would definitely take the, i would really take the easy route right with my talents and get a deal and then pump out whatever the fuck they want me to pump out. 
You know what I mean? Like this is. I'll even na- the title of the album, You're ignorant crazy. shit. You're you know crazy. what I mean, bro? Like that's 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 what I would do, bro. You know what I right. mean? Like and then, and then and then you could you could do like where people would be like, oh yeah, this when he wants to go deep, he goes deep. When he wants to get ignorant, he gets ignorant. Huh. You know what I mean? When he wants to get lyrical, he gets lyrical. When he hey. wants to go backpack, he'll go backpack. When he he wants to get jazzy, he'll get jazzy. You know what <laughs> I mean? Bro, honestly, bro, you have to be super uh, multifaceted. I feel like. No, yeah. Especially today. Right, I feel like everything has been done already. Oh yeah, everything's so, been done already, and like you already hear it already. So you They're gotta be redoing unique. old shit. Before they used to take the beat, and and then just just take the beat and redo. Now they take the hook too. Yeah, they take. Hey, they, they take, take the whole all. fucking song almost, bro. You know, and it's like what? It's the a fuck? sample guy. I mean, I'm like thinking, I've been. I wanna keep it to yourself. I don't wanna know. And, and they, I'm like, wait, boom. hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a remake. Yeah, boom, and then like, my boom, wife's like, boom. yeah, it's, it's, it's the weekend and 21 Savage. And I'm like, no fucking way, bro. Although the weekend did kill, sing it way better, hey, right? He, yeah, yeah. He, kinda he did. killed hey. it. He killed it. He killed it. See, but yeah. like, even with the weekend, you said like he signed with Drake, but then once he got out under, bro, like he did get that clout, but like he built off that clout as soon as he got out under Drake and made it 10 times better. But it's how he's acting. Oh, for real. Now, exactly. You see that one in the movie or whatever the fuck with uh, Johnny Depp's daughter? Yes. I haven't, Damn, got, I haven't a, watched it yet, guys. But hey, homie, how can you be so skinny but be so heavy? <laughs> he do look Shout like out he to looks- the Andrew Schultz. If you guys don't watch Flagrant, watch Flagrant. No, He's hilarious, Andrew bro. Schultz is hilarious. He's hilarious. He is hilarious. <laughs> Respect, no, Yeah, I was real. watching that. And I'm like, he's like, because she's got some chick bitties, bro, but she's That's skinny. They, uh. And he's all like, how how could she be so? How she? How could she be so skinny? What's up? But yet so heavy. It's so fucking funny, bro. Bro, the meme pages. It's defying physics, bro. He's the. Def- she's defying gravity. The meme pages were quick on it, so like I didn't even get to watch the episodes yet, and they were on it. They were on yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, so good, bro. All right, I was like, let me get on it. Yeah, let me, yeah, let me see what they talk about. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'll, I'll like um, I. I I like watch that shit religiously, bro. That's one of my favorite fucking podcasts, bro. But yeah, you good, bro? You good? You dying out there? Oh, no, yeah, I was laughing. Right, but enough of flagrant. Back to you. Back to you. So you say you you traveled and whatnot. How do you how do you like 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 compare the scenes music wise? Like Alabama compared to West Coast. Oh, like like what, what? How do you? Which one do you prefer? You know what I mean? Because out here, barely the love has started. Right, a lot of people didn't fuck with each other before. But now until recently, until it's like people are like, oh, yeah, when we collaborate, we make more money. Yeah, like, yeah, you idiot. You know what I mean? Like, so now there's more love. But I'm feeling like in the South, there was hella love. You know what I mean? But I'm pretty sure there's also like, you know, drama. That shit. I mean, in my my state, let me put some game, let me put some knowledge. Birmingham, where, where I'm from, the 205 and Mobile, Alabama, top Oakland. In the worst cities, like for violence. I'm not even trying to flex. It's not a flex. I don't so try no to. No pro- one fucks with each other over there. <laughs> nah, dude, it's crazy out there. Like this Birmingham drill. Like I'll show you after the uh, podcast. Yeah. This dude, like guys, like I don't, pre- I don't like condoning violence. I just be talking, r- not rap cap guys. Don't get me wrong. I know how to protect myself. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> but I don't like promoting violence all crazy. But dude, he like they had killed somebody on um. And they put him on Facebook Live. He was outside the car, bro. And they put it in the music video. No way. I, What's up with him? Is he in I, prison? Nah, I don't know. No. I, I don't think Whoa. so. I swear, I, bro. Like, that's I, crazy. I, I don't think so. But you think maybe he's like doing some shit? Like, maybe it's Cap, and like he's like, well, six nine blew the fuck up. Nah. Now I can just portray that I'm really I'm gonna do just a character. And then I'm gonna just put rap about these homicides and pretend that I did them. I'm tapped in and I'm tapped in. Nah, he's and doing them. I'm tapped in. I'm Bro, tapped have you seen, have you seen the Have you seen the video about uh about rap's first serial killer? Uh, with uh the Trap Lord Ross with the yeah, yeah. King, King Von. Von baby. Bruh, I paid I paid for the Patreon for that because it got taken down within like two days. I was like, I'm gonna watch it. I need the time. I need the time because like it's yeah. a long. That was a long documentary, guys. Yeah, yeah. They, hey, he redropped I, it. It was great. It was great. I no. watched it. I don't. 
I think I reacted to it, but I'm not sure if I uploaded it again. Do you, did you get it on the Patreon, though? No, 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 no. You're, I, you're I missing it, out. I saw it right when he dropped it. Okay. You know what I mean? So. You're, no, you need to get the Patreon. Like, yeah. it's. I mean, I know you react to it, but, like, you get the show. Like, you get the react the to it. The real thing. Oh, okay. So it's, like, watered down the YouTube shit, oh, right? Oh, it's Hey, guys. I've he's been not, flagrant, too. No, I've been flagrant, too, there bro. There is no rap cap when Tra Trap Lord Ross gives a good Patreon. And it's good. It's fairly priced too. Okay, I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna check it out, bro. Yeah, cause, so I like, pay, Cause I pay what? Like, I pay Patreon ten dollars a month for who? I think it's just Patreon, right? No, I didn't. I don't do nothing. Then maybe I got the wrong Patreon or something. You you might have subscribed to somebody and you just don't watch them. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Or maybe I, I was gonna do no jumper and they had like different prices because like they they were offering T-shirts and merch and stuff like that with like the higher the price yeah. and I was about to do it but I was like it's not worth it to me yeah, but like yeah. they be showing crazy shit I've seen like I go on reddit I see what they post on there yeah 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 I'm not going <laughs> they be they be showing on the reddit it's okay alright but... alright all right. that's right that's right but no like Trap Lord Ross go crazy does on the it? Patreon yeah 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 he, does he does show legit. like the real deal and it... I mean what about like I like like you know with the new rules on, on Twitter right you can, it's all free game now too right porn's been on Twitter for no, a while for but have so... you seen the Instagram like Instagram. Instagram, oh yeah, titties now, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, titties. like, bro, they got like, dude, it's getting bad on Instagram. It's, it's like the lives are getting the, crazy. The toys, like, they oh, promoting the toys, no. like the body toys, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, I don't. The meme pages be, I like, sometimes the meme pages be too out of pocket. Well, the meme pages are now just uh, OnlyFans promotions now. And like, ad, no, just ad promoters too. Yeah, yeah like, and it's like kind of like ah, you got to fall. Yeah, it's kind of lame. lame. I don't even wrong. I'll go check on. Like, All right, let me see your Twitter. You know what I mean. <laughs> I'd rather just see the Twitter. Guys. Yeah, they go like, check. Yeah, it's, everybody it's, gonna check the Twitter. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go check the Twitter real quick, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Twitter. But hell yeah, hell yeah. All right, all right. All right. No, uh, yeah. uh, speaking of Twitter, speaking of Twitter, uh, promote. What's your What are your socials, man? I got everything. Um, most of my most of my socials. I'm talking about Instagram, Snapchat, of course, like Facebook. Is Bassanova or Jacoby J A K O B I, but Bassanova B A S S A N O V A. It's not that hard, guys. Underscore five X. Bassanova. There you go. There you go. Bassanova. Huh? However you want to call it. It's no call it's Bassanova. So you can call me Bassa. You can call me Nova. You can call me Kobe. Call me Jacoby. Whatever you want. Whatever you prefer. That's right. That's right. You call what, me. What, what do you prefer? What does your mama call you? <laughs> Jacoby, get junior. over here. Nah, she called me Junior. Junior, all right, all right. I'm Junior. Oh, yeah, my, my son's name's Darwin, like I'm named Darwin. Okay. But I don't like the name Junior. It's diminutive. It is very diminutive. Yeah, yeah, a little yeah. bit, but it's like. Come here, Junior, you know what I mean? It's like literally your whole life being right called there. Junior is like your whole life being called Boy. Basically. You know what I mean? So I was like, I, I never let no one call him Junior, right? No, his name's Darwin. 2.0. <laughs> You know, like, like, that's it, dude. <laughs> no, because I'm not trying to say I, ha I haven't been diagnosed, but I feel like I got multiple different personalities. So Jacoby's different from Bassanova. Uh, and hey, then, bro, we rap stars, bro. You exactly. Know what I'm saying? So we, got, we got, we got, we got. What is that shit called? Uh, main character syndrome. Syndrome. Hell yeah, to the max. <laughs> if you, if you're a real ego. I know I do, bro. I know I do. Every, the world revolves around me. All right, you're just living in it. Nah, nah. <laughs> Everybody living in their own world and their own universe. 100%, 100%. And we collide when we want to collide and we don't when we don't. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Speaking of colliding, colliding, uh, a word of advice for all the youngsters so they don't collide or something that you've learned that you can tell them, you know, game them up. Game them up. Oh, it's better to be a nerd than a gangster. Hey, that's facts, bro. i rather. That yeah. is fucking facts, homie. Because you could be. A cool nerd hanging out with those gangsters, but you don't. You're not you can't under be. no contract with these motherfuckers. You you banging them. Books. You can talk to whoever you want to. You know what I mean, like, bro. Like, okay, so my uncle. That's crazy that you brought that up. My uncles were all Southerners, and all my friends growing up are all Northerners, right? So like, when all my friends were like, "Yeah, come join the gang," I'm like, "Nah, dog. Like, I'm gonna have beef at home. You know what I mean? Or it's gonna be weird." So I was just like, nah, and I was just a little rap nerd, whatever the fuck, right? And uh, now I'm in my 30s, and I see all the people that are stuck in that lifestyle, right? That, like, you're, they're not even really part of that lifestyle, but they have to support it, and they have to wear the dress code, and do the whole and thing. do the meetings, and you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, 
it's just it's fucked up, bro. You know, don't what I mean? let so, it. Strong words. Strong fucking words, bro. Yeah, 100%, bro. 100%, dude. Like, you don't. wanna sell drugs? You don't have to be a gangster to sell drugs. You don't. You wanna beat people up? You don't have to be a gangster to beat people up. You don't. You wanna shoot people up? You don't have to be a gangster to shoot people up. You don't. You know, you know what I'm saying? I had to ad lip that. Yeah, 100%, bro. 100%, dude. Hell yeah, I had dude. Had to. Because it's oh, yeah, serious. That's some, good, some good, that's some good advice, bro, for the youngsters. I feel like in this era, this, this day and age, it's like the wake up period, bro. Uh, it is. And yeah, like, people are realizing, nah, I'm cool off that, bro. And the teaching era. Like, a lot of a lot of people are trying to teach. I'm out here trying to teach as well with one of my businesses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do um, credit business funding. Like, I teach credit business funding and credit repair. What about, what about some advice for the youngsters about some credit repair? Oh, guys. I mean, I don't know if your parents... You need to check how your credit is. And if your parents ever did something with your name, I'm going to put you on some game. Hold up. Oh, that rhyme. So, I don't know. Credit, like... The credit world's crazy. I'm not gonna lie. I bought this jewelry with credit. I'm let me let me go pull up. Not the crystals though. The crystals, of course, they don't overprice for crystals. Get on, cri hey. Yo, I, I help out. You know what I mean. Diamonds don't protect your soul. These I, crystals do though. That's what. That's what, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But like, I, I support. I show love when I see the wire wrappers at events and whatnot. See, guys, but they always try to hit me with like a 300, and I'm like. I'm gonna be back to the end of the festival and hit you with like 150, bro. <laughs> See, <laughs> you feel me, bro? No, nah, I feel you. So no, nah, I'm. I be trying to learn them them tax codes. I be trying to just find legal ways to save my money, tax expenses, because I'm a business business owner. I got I got a lot of things that I have to pay for. There's, it's not free to own a business like you think. You can get a free LLC, guys, but like trying to make stuff work. Cause I how do would you go about getting an LLC? Go online, yeah, or go you go on. to the courthouse, or what do you what do you do? Day and age of the internet, guys. Go online. Go online. Hey, if you want to get right and come with a real game plan, I do consulting. So that's basically what my second business is. I do wholesale and I do consulting. Um, you could come consult, and we could talk about a real game plan, or you could just try to raw dog it. If you, if that's you, that's your lifestyle, raw dogging. Hell yeah! I got four <laughs> kids, three baby mamas. What's up? Shoot. Well, well, the fourth one's on the way. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, 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 yeah. No, yeah, hey, yeah. I'm trying to have a lot of kids, too. I feel it. I feel the Call motion. Me, bro. I'm with, all, the, I'm with Elon on this, dude. <laughs> <laughs> have I'm, all the kids, bro. I'm trying to have at least, like, eight. At least. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I grew up in a family of four. Okay. And then my, my, my dad is, like, a family of six, and my mom's a family of seven. So, like... Big families, you okay. know what I'm saying? I you didn't know? really have a big family like that. So, I mean, I have two half-siblings, and I'm my dad's only child. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, I want to have a big family. Yeah, I wanna... it's amazing, bro. And I'm trying to start generational wealth. I'm going to be the first. Hell yeah, I dude. am going to yeah, be the yeah. first millionaire. Congratulations, first... bro. Hell yeah, dude. I'm going to be the first millionaire, first billionaire, first trillionaire in my family. Mark my words on that. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Mark my words on that. What, but, what, hey. what would you do to, to be the first millionaire? What would you think? Would be your breakout uh, endeavor? Oh, I'm trying to go to Mars, bro. My consulting business. Okay, cool. My hell yeah, hell I'm yeah. Teaching, cause like you said, like a, a million, lot of people, a billion. I, for a billion, I'd be like, I would have to figure okay. out how I would get to b Mars. But have you heard supposedly there's cons conspiracy theories that Mars has an atmosphere and has water and has it does it has ice that still can not be ice actual water. water. I feel like it, it, it deep down probably there's huh? nah bro oh, on surface. So like NASA what what they so um so NASA sent out a probe the first probe to take a picture took a picture of Mars when they got back it was re it was like a green with like white you see you see light reflect inside oh. like it's an atmosphere. Right, supposedly, and then according to Billy Carlson, who I like listening to, uh, uh, NASA then re-rendered it red so it could portray the story that red planet. Oh. But no, nah, there's an atmosphere. Okay. According to this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like we just need some trees in there to get the the air right with Mars and bro, we would be chill. Did you, did you, have you seen the last image the Mars rover sent? Nah, why? It, it literally look like? looks like a fucking battle tank. Right? It looked like a battle tank, and that was the last minute message it sent. After it just disappeared cut or signals. like cuts up. Oh. And it, and it, and bro, like, I'll, it looks, it's I'm crazy, look bro. I'm looking it's, that it's up. fucking crazy. I want to oh. whip it out and whatnot. Yeah, right but, yeah, yeah. But, <laughs> but yeah, dude. Uh, um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Back. 
Oh, wait, you believe but, in aliens? What's up? You believe in aliens? Hell yeah, bro. We're not you the hear about the Vegas shit? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. That's yeah, just real, guys. That hey. gave me chills, bro. There, there's just not one race of alien, bro. There's races of aliens, guys. Hell yeah. Hey, hell yeah. If you know, you know. If you wanted them, you wanted them. Hell yeah. I'm all scatterbrained and whatnot. I hey, want to go back to... We going crazy with I wanna it. I want to go back to the, to the, to the uh, consulting and whatnot. So the all consulting right. is, is where you feel like, you know what? That's an actual business that I can focus on and like... Like hell yeah, hell because yeah. Because I'm using I'm doing business to fund my dream, guys. My dream is music. My dream is the art. So I'm not trying to get feeling I'm getting signed under somebody that I'm having to say what I have to say or I have to do portray a certain image that I have to do if I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I mean I'm funding myself if if I'm funding myself what I can say whatever I wanna say, I can do whatever I wanna do. You ever listen to Mac Dre? Yeah. Bro, that's the crazy like hey, hey, Mac Dre has a badass line where he's all <coughs> He's all labels want me to sign, but I'm signed to Fizz, and Fizz is mine. Like, you know? like bro, you know. <laughs> coming from, from coming that's from, a badass line, bro. No, it is coming from the East Coast. Like, I had to do my knowledge. I'm six years out of here. Like, some people, some even some Bay people call me native at this point. But I'm yeah. like, I just like yeah, I'm I thought chill. you were straight Bay kid, dude. That's yeah, straight up, homie. <laughs> You got the like, swag, bro. You got I got the swag. The swag. I was like, you probably from Berkeley or something, dude. dude, you know? dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro. I got the tank shit merch. You see, I got to even tat it on me. Oh, hell yeah. No way. That's yeah. gang, bro. Who it's, did it? Jigs did it or who? Uh, Chucky did it. Chucky, Chucky did it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, that's the guy for real. Um, But no, like, I just want to portray myself how I want to portray myself. And I don't want to feel like somebody's pressuring me to do what I don't want to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm making my own collective to let people do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Without a cost. I'm working with the tank shit people for free. Y'all don't tell me to do nothing. We do whatever, like, oh, we, yeah. we do this to help him. And, like, it's all love. I'm trying to make all love, all family. It's a unity. I know not everybody going to fuck with us. But, hey, if you fuck with us, you fuck with us. If you yeah, don't, yeah, yeah. you don't. True, true, true. 100%, bro. I, and it's, it is like a collective. You have to have a team. You know, it's very rare that someone does it by himself, you know? Exactly. You say Super you do it by rare, yourself, that's dude. cap. Or very rare. I mean, I, mean, I would, cap or I very would rare. say Bro, that's like Soldier 90. Boy. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. boy, James KOE right here. Uh. Yeah. This is the most he's ever talked in an interview. And it's not <laughs> even his interview. That's wild. <laughs> that's Watch it. his interview, bro. This fool doesn't even talk, bro. That's he's what. fucking eating a soup, bro. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, my. no. Oh man, you were corn. barely talking that whole corn. interview. He was like shining me, bro. I was like, all right, we're gonna play this game. Like, Come on, right. James. <laughs> you gotta be one of those guys. Come on. <laughs> I was oh bro, I was I was being so mean to him. <laughs> Y'all should watch the James the KOE video with that motherfucker right there. Shout <laughs> 100 percent bro. What's up? Say what's up, James. What's up with it, James KOE, fresh out of Morgan Hill. We out in the series, California today. We about to perform. We about to go stupid. Can't love these hoes. We not Cupid, you know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, hell yeah, bro. We out here. Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, yeah, you can catch uh, James's videos on Gold, uh, Gold, D GT Digital. Yeah, Gold Toast Digital. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you yeah. say you gonna drop some new shit? That's right. Oh yeah, yeah, as you yeah, should. Hey, I Talking about some new shit. Yeah, I was gonna say, what's up? Like, what any projects you got going on? I literally just dropped luck right now. Dropped the video today. I dropped vlogs on my YouTube channel. I haven't posted in a while. I had deleted everything. It's a whole reloading. I went through a whole reloading stage. Like you said, that whole like new level. I literally just went not ghost, but like I wasn't promoting nothing. I mean, if you're gonna put it in there, let's do it. Yeah, fuck it, bro. Let's dab it. Let's dab some DMT. It's like only like, what, 10 minute high, 30 minute high if you got really good stuff? And so, fuck it. Um, yeah, no, nah, I dropped luck. I was on a whole reloading stage. Like, even with my own music, like, it wasn't up to par to my liking. And even like with my my homie that I make music with, not James, but um, it's just funny. He usually be with me. That's the crazy thing, my little boy. My homie, Lil Prophet X. He's the one I usually make music with. I have my own solos, but like, that's my brother for real. We make music, oh, yeah. like we make yeah, yeah. crazy music together. He so, pushed me to levels that like, I never thought like just making, being a singer or yeah. like being like a, a vocal, like a melodic rapper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Took it to the next level. Literally, and I took oh, him yeah. to a next level. Double I feel tap. Like, I, I feel like 
he he became like not even trying to give credit, but he became like a way better rapper. Like he his rap is just crazy. Like we built off each other, and that's what you do with friendships or any relationships. Giving game, uh, relationships a give and take. You're gonna see what the benefits are. Like what you're gonna give and what you're gonna provide, and what's gonna build between that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It could be something more than just business. It could be more than just a a, a friendship or like a relationship. Like you just see how it is. And so, man, like, luck, that, luck, yeah. luck is that song that just came out. Check it out at inside Bassanova, and I got them vlogs on it too, guys. A hey, the visuals from my boy Greg, he shot it too, man. He did the editing and the visuals. He go first, that's man right there, Bruh, Just dropped at midnight today. Is what. Woo. Let's see if I see the grid. This man. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Any last no. words for all those youngsters out there? From the last Cause word. I don't want to be all on DMT I now. Know, no, you good, you good. <laughs> Any last words? Hey, like I said, rather be a nerd than a gangster. Hundred percent. Like I said, you you don't have to be a gangster to kill people. You no. don't have to be a gangster to sell drugs no. or do drugs, no. bro. Don't. It's like it's like they're signing young assassins to be assassins at a young age. But the organized isn't even organized, you know what I mean? It's just like, it's weird, bro. So it's great advice, bro. That is fucking gems right there, bro. Straight hey, gems. We definitely gonna have to do more. We definitely doing a part two. Oh yeah, and oh, yeah, Part bro. two gonna be part three. I'm I'm manifesting that this is gonna be a lasting thing, bro. This is gonna be something right here. We definitely gonna work more. We oh, definitely yeah, work more. Oh, yeah, brother. Future. Hey, uh, plug your socials again. Uh, let people know Bassanova. where they can find you. B A S S A. I said it three times. N O V A. I don't care. You better pay attention. Five X underscore five X on the Instagram. Bassanova. If you want to find the video on YouTube, put luck L U C K. About to perform it. You gonna see me. We live. We making it lit. You can't stop this motion. It's tank shit or it ain't shit. You dig? Bro, stop playing. Uh. And we out. We out. Oh, I gotta hold it in. Like, all, all we do is do drugs or drink, you know what I mean, kick it. <laughs>